And here we are, back to your regularly scheduled programming. Hello everyone, it's Lady Catastrophe, and tonight I'm continuing the adventures in the outer worlds. Last time, in the outer worlds, I can't even remember. I'm, I just can't. It's, it's been like a week or so. I went on a trip, I got, and I was busy, so... Let's refresh our memory. I have to try to remember what went on. I think we have almost a full crew now. And... I don't know, I'm gonna have to read the journal to figure to figure out what the hickety heck I did last time and what I need to do now. I think I'm still on Monarch though. I think I'm still on Monarch. It has been a while. Ah. Uh, okay. bring up the journal okay so yes okay I can kind of remember so I was gonna do this next I was gonna speak to Nayoka in the Yacht Club in Stellar Bay. And I still have to do these two faction quests. Zora thanks the coach she gave you the relay... The codes... Zora thanks the coach she gave you to the relay station's entrance. And I have to enter the special secret lab in Cascadia. So I, I'm going to have to go to Cascadia at some point. And then I still need to get into that little box. But I am not quite high enough level yet to get into that box to prove that Velma's been skimming money out of the warehouse account. But I decided to continue the main quest. So that's what we're going to do. And it looks like I'm in Stellar Bay. Resident. I'm gonna have Ellie and Vicar Max with me. Oh yeah. Oh, I forgot I suited him out. In the power armor looking stuff. It's so, alright. Now we're gonna talk to you. I'm sorry I got all up in your face. And the little bastard's slippery, right? On account of its blood. So it's, it's sliding. All over the place. Trying to crawl away. Getting so I can't tell the... Tell the blood from the mud. Excuse me. Don't interrupt. It's rude. Oh, okay. I'm but sorry. I gotta get in there. Get right in that baby rap stomach and dig it out. If so much as a drop of stomach acid got on that medallion, I shit, I don't know what I'd do. Might be I'd hunt every damn wrapped out there. Right. What are you staring? Wait. You ain't from around here. Who are you? Huh. I'm Morgan, pleased to meet you. Ooh, charmer. Don't get a lot of that around here. Folks mostly grump at me about how I should join the MSI payroll. Nice change of pace. Buy me a drink, will you? Okay. Let's see what we could do right down to business, or... Let's get right back. I'm told you can get me to an information broker. Well, 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 well. Let's get down to brass nuts then, shall we? Brass, wait, that ain't it. Brass rats? Let's, let's talk business. I'm headed back out there after I sober up. You want a guide sooner than that? You'll have to get me something to clear my head. Um. 
Sure, what do you need? Outstanding! Our dispensary here maintains a stock of, uh, well, I don't rightly know what they are. Steroid or caffeine somethings? Pills. They're very good. I'm cut off for the money on account of needing one just about every damn day. But I'm sure you've got your wily ways. Fetch me one and we'll be all set. With as much as I have in my inventory, maybe I... Um... Maybe I already have some. You mean caffeinoid? That stuff's just a stimulant. Well, they work. We got a deal or what? All right, I'll be back. Do I not have any on me? No, I need to go to the MSI dispensary. What you think is this way? See, it says it right on the map. This way. Ah, oh, no, the train's passing. You're Braxton. I don't want to think about it. Eaten by cannibals? What a way to go. I put up with the constant stink of fish because I don't want to think about what's outside those walls. I know. Just imagine what it's bad. It'd be Amber Heights all over again. That's it. You owe me your month's ration of Dabilaroff. <laughs> Sometimes I do wonder if I should have killed the cannibals. Because I do remember that I did in fact not kill the cannibals roundabout way to get here hello dearie why well, I don't believe I've seen you before I don't believe I've been here before clothes, I'd remember you yes, like the bedside man all lady. right you creeping me out well it's so rare I get the pleasure of new company oh goodness what can Auntie Abigail do for you I've been asked to pick up a caffeinoid supplement and what a helpful young lady you are Nothing like a little pill to liven up the spirits. Whiskey helps, too. Please leave medical advice to the professionals. Now, dearie, who's this pickup for? Ah. <laughs> I'm not going to say it's for Nyoka because I don't think she'd give it to me if it was for Nyoka. I could say that the pills are for me, though. <laughs> or I could say, I don't know, Auntie. You have to pry that secret from my sweet little cheeks. See, actually, the pills are for me. I'm so sorry, but with the iconoclast and the marauder filth chasing away, oh, well, that was dumb. We get, I'm afraid I have to reserve my supply for Stellar Bay residents. Oh. Our reserves have gotten <gasps> so low. I've even had to start locking the supply room upstairs. Isn't it a shame what some people will do to get a little... Extra? I have, in fact, put myself in a predicament. Oh, that's just awful. Isn't it just... I'd make an exception for you if I could, my little cherub. Is there anyone else needing a special pickup from Auntie Abigail? I don't know, Auntie. You'll have to pry that secret from my sweet little cheeks. Don't blame me if I puke on your shoes. Aren't you a saucy thing? <laughs> now, I may not be a fresh young thing anymore, but with age comes experience, dearie. Uh huh. What? Oh my goodness. G oh. <laughs> This has gone a completely different way than I expected. <laughs> this got weird fast. Maybe some other time then, when Auntie's personal allotment of stimulation is restored. Oh, no, thank you. But I'd hate to send you away empty handed. You were here for caffeinoid, weren't you? Who's it for? I can either say it's for Nioka, that's private, or I can go upstairs and steal it from her. But I don't know if I'll be able to steal it from her because I was trying to seal the records to prove that Velma was stealing from the company and I wasn't high enough to do that. I could just say that's private. 
Now, now, there's no keeping secrets from Auntie Abigail. I'll tease it out of you one way or another. She's trying to creep me out a little bit. Also, I really do have to enter someone's name for the allotment. After all, I have to keep track of where our little pills wander off to. Really? I don't have, like, HIPAA laws? <gasps> you know what? We're gonna do that. We're gonna bribe her. Why don't you just write down my name as Lotso Bits? How's 2,912 bits sound? Which is completely out of character for me because I like to hold on to my bits. But here we are. Well, I suppose I could use the money to supply our little clinic for the rest of the town. Very well. I'll make an exception for you this one time. But let's keep this between us, dearie. <laughs> I'm so long corrupt. <laughs> now I'll go give Nioka her pills. Ah, the charmer. Welcome back. Drink, chat, or business? All of the above? You've got your magic pills. These things are dangerous, you know. Says someone who's never had any fun. Well, exactly. what? Exactly. See? I'm glad someone on your crew's got some sensi sensible... Got her head on straight. <laughs> I think maybe you are done drinking. <sighs> that hits the spot. Right in the, uh, oh, no, there it is. There it is. Yes. We're in business. Let's go. That was fast. I gotta see about stalking some on the ship. You be careful. The first one's free. After that, they'll offer you gainful employment. Glad to have Great. you. Where to? Let's find the information broker. Oh, Hiram? I ain't checked in on that man in an age. He's running the giant radio tower we lovingly call Devil's Peak. We'll be going south and west, mostly along the road till we're past Fallbrook. Out there, there's a western slope that'll lead us through some, uh, some fun. You like hunting, right? That's fun. If you're more of a spelunker, Rotting River will take you into the mountain caverns. We can discuss options when we get closer. That said, uh, three's already a crowd. I don't mind waiting somewhere until you got a spot open. Um, well, I can send the vicar back. We'll do a girls' afternoon out. Vicar Max went on the ship. We need Yoka's help for now. As long as you've got my back, I'll have yours. Welcome to the unreliable crew. Oh. Okay, so she's gonna be like a crew member. Is it temporary or is she gonna be a permanent crew member? But out here, the daintier weapons ain't gonna cut it. Manasaurs require stopping power. Like what? Yeah, but what's left after you're done with them? Time to level up. Can't level that up anymore. I'm just going to put points where I can put points. Perks. Oh, reduces the weight of consumables. Something I feel like I do need. Hmm. Yes. Oh. Mm, probably need to level them up too. Let's see. Let's give her some more melee damage. And Nyoka. New bestie. I always like to travel with more health. 
and let's see. Hmm. Oh, we got a lot of points. Well, let's just put some. Yeah, we're gonna do it. We're gonna do all that. That that's acceptable. Press the button. All right. Oof. Need to go to the information broker at Devil's Peak. Okay. Well, we'll just keep continuing with the main quest. Let's head out of Stellar Bay. I shipped with a Merc who had a gun like yours, Nyoka. He polished it, sang to it, slept with it. Oh. Not like that, as far as I know. Oh, okay. Sounds like he had himself a discerning palate. Where are you going with this? He couldn't hit the broadside of an assault cruiser, hence the tin shredder. Wouldn't be the first man I met bearing compensation for his lack of skill. <sighs> Maybe I can try one more time to get into that. I have a feeling I'm going to fail, but I at least want to try. <laughs> Don't too far! Okay. <gasps> Am I doing it? Yes! Oh, finally! You got nimble finger. What do you think Oops. you're doing? You know, you made a real generous argument. I just, I just gave him money. <laughs> it's like, oh, I'll just take it. It's okay. <laughs> um, yeah. God, I should have, I should have not. I should have been in sneak mode, and I wasn't. And that was very dumb of me, but, but I did it. So. Now, are they still are they hanging out upstairs? Is there an upstairs over here? Where were they? Where were those guys hanging out at? I'm looking for the dudes that I need to give that stuff to. And I cannot remember. All right, ding dong. There we go. I thought I could find it without having a switch without quest, a switch to but it's always cranky. obviously not. Okay, here we go. Up here. I couldn't even remember which building it was. All right, here you go. Why don't you grab a chair, sit a spell, and revel with us? We need to talk about Velma. Sure thing. What did you want to discuss? Bad news. You don't have the savings. You think you do. Yeah, I think that's one. What? Something happened to our stashed bit cards? But I hid it so careful. No one saw me put the lockbox on my balcony. No one goes up there but me. We must be dealing with some sort of criminal mastermind. Well, if we can't afford to skip work, we ain't got no leverage. Space me, but good. I guess you ought to tell Velma we're coming back to work. So she wasn't. She wasn't cooking the books. If I never smell another wrapped, it'll be too soon. Weren't you a sawbones? Figured you ought to have smelled worse. Sure, but those things reek like bad cologne. It's different. I'm with you there. At least humans have the courtesy to wait a while before their bodies start to stink. Most of them. Well, I felt like I was moving slow, but I think I'm just because I'm not pressing the run button. Hey, Velma, I got your cafenoid pills. 
You're a lifesaver. Hope Abigail didn't give you a hard time. Just the usual. Any word on Braxton? Nothing. I don't know how much longer I can cover for him either. Give me those pills, will ya? Didn't I tell you that he died? You know, you might consider a real night's sleep instead. Ooh. Oh, I'm sorry. Mind your way. I'd give you a friendlier welcome, but I'm up to my elbows and salt tuna guts. Mm. We're spatting your spirits, Velma. You notice my mood? I'm surprised you can see straight today. Oh, I could be seeing triple and I'd still think you're being unkind. I just might find it funnier. Will you try wrangling half a ton of dead fish with decades old equipment and see what it does for your disposition? Anyway, what do you folks need? I could have sworn. But I told you Braxton was dead. You knocked any sense into him yet? Oh. Hmm. I stole from him. Oh, that went right over my head. So he's too broke to strike. He's coming back to work. Funny how that works out. Because I stole the money from Thanks him. Thanks for your help. You've gotten me out of a tight spot here. Take this for your efforts. Honest work deserves honest pay. Something else on your mind? I'll talk to you later. You know, I really could have sworn that I... Which one was it? Eric's handiwork. Hmm. Oh, see, I was just following the map. I was supposed to be trying to figure out if Velma was skimming money out of the warehouse accounts. And see, this is why you have to pay attention. Because that was really stupid. And if I would have been paying better attention or at least reading slower than I would have seen to find the proof. I thought the proof was in the balcony in that chest and that is not the case. That was Caleb's savings which I stole which is why it was so hard to get in because that was probably the bad thing to do. Oh well. We're gonna go outside. And we're gonna take our time. Gotta learn to take your time. I need to talk to you, Captain. Already? We just friggin' left the city. Hey, got a favor to ask you. Figure while we're out here in the wilderness anyhow, we might stop in on an old friend of mine. Preferably before we get to Hiram's. It's on the way, don't worry. You don't seem the type to run off and get yourself killed, and I could use the help. Okay. Well, I definitely don't plan on getting myself killed. Well... We'll see about that. I'll be up front with you. I hate asking for help. I hate it. Every time I give someone the opportunity to disappoint me, they seem to make it their most immediate goal. But this, what I'm thinking, it's dangerous. All right. I'm honored you're, I'm honored you're asking, and I'm thrilled to accept. What can I do? Really? Here I was stealing myself for inevitable rejection. I used to run with a band of hunters. Friends. Six of us. We were on Monarch when the corporations pulled out, and we helped a lot of people pick up the pieces. I haven't seen two of them in years, and the rest I know to be dead. I'd like to gather their effects and bury them all in the same places, like the family we once were. This is an extensive companion quest, huh? 
How do you know they're dead? I saw it happen. Hell, one of them was in my arms at the time. His name was Hayes, and he's our first stop. I buried him a ways from our encampment. I'll show you where he rests. He had a medallion in his effects. That's what I'll bring home to bury. And after that? Then we find my two lost trackers and bring them home. A long time ago, we built an encampment in one of Monarch's cave systems. Trouble is, a mana queen showed up and kicked us all out. Oh, no. If we can find Rebecca and Anders, they'll know how to lure her out. Then we kill the bitch and bury everyone's medallions together. We're gonna have to kill a Manta Queen? Oh, yes. I can't wait. Oh, man. Okay, so there's new fun stuff to do. Hmm. Let's see. I'm starting to suspect that I probably should have talked to her before I even went out and explored the rest of this area. I mean, I could just do her quest before even... I mean, we just met, so narratively, it doesn't really make sense for me to be doing her companion quest already. We haven't even been to Cascadia yet. But I know, let's do it. We'll go to the turn pike and go do that. Does this mean I have to find a manta queen now if I go do that? Are we just going find Yeah, we're just going find um is the grave where she personally buried Hayes. So Yes, we will go here. Better get the weapons ready. Oh, son of a nut. Son of a nutcracker. Here they come! What? Oh, are you kidding me? Yeah, oh, oh, okay. Take it back now. Oh my god. And we're alive. Damn. Y'all are strong. How much stronger than me? Holy shit. This way, maybe? I really don't want to have to fight a mana queen just yet. <gasps> oh, snap! Crackle and pop. I mess him up. God, I, I, I hate bugs. I hate giant bugs, especially. Didn't They're the worst. They're the oh, I'm sorry, Ellie. I thought you were a bug coming through the bush. Uh, so little about me. I have a bad habit of accidentally shooting. My own companions. <laughs> I remember this one time I was playing Fallout 4 and the super mutants had shown up and I was trying to defend the place. Um, if I can even remember. Oh. I was trying to defend the um, uh, the the Rats. Let's clear the sulfur. God, I can't even remember what the so name like the colony. Uh, it's what are they called in Fallout 4? Oh my goodness! Settlement. The settlement. I was trying to defend one of my settlements from super mutants, and I accidentally ended up shooting one of the residents Here we go. in the back of the head because they ran. They ran in front of me. That was their own fault. I'm not as scared as the Colossus anymore. Um, 
I thought that was a body, and that was not. It's just a giant, weird-looking rock. Oh, his little grave. Buried near the surface of Hay's grave is a small lockbox. Its hinges rusted through, and its wood almost completely rotted. It nearly falls apart in your hands. But in it, you manage to find a tarnished silver medallion bearing the letters Sharon. I probably said that so wrong. But it is what it is. Campfire. Oh, gotta talk to her now. Hayes was the best self-sacrificing son of a saint I ever met. Halcyon is worse off without him. Now... If we're gonna lure the Manta Queen out, we'll need to find Rebecca and Anders. They took a UDL contract on Terra 2. We never heard from them again. I think it's time I call in a favor with Hiram. If anyone can track them down, it's him. I don't know much about it. It paid well, so they took it. They said they'd be back in a couple of weeks and that maybe we could all use the money to get off Monarch. That was a long time ago. You didn't try and find them. I should have. I I really should have. But soon after they left, Hayes and the others died. And to be honest, after him, I I stopped trying. Because it hurt like hell to do so. That's why you drink a lot, huh? For what it's worth, I'm glad you're trying to confront it. Thanks. I'm still not convinced I won't come to regret it, but we've started down this path. Might as well see it through. Maybe it'll stop me screaming at night. Now come on, let's make tracks before Hiram dies of old age. So, double reason why we need to go to Hiram. Hiram McDaniels. Oh, well I might as well make my way there on my own. Hiram McDaniels. Am I saying the last name wrong? I'm trying to make an, a Welcome to Night Vale reference. I saw a tail. What the fuck? Yeah, I was trying to make a Welcome to Night Vale reference. And I think I'm failing horribly. The caves back east are safest. We can head up this path if you want to shoot your way through a few nightmares on your way up. Ooh. What do you mean the caves back east are safest? So you're saying over here is safest. We'd have to tr go down this way. Oh my god. Well, I don't have much of a choice do I because I'd have to go all the way around if I can even get through this fucking gate I'm just gonna have to do what I can do so we're gonna take this way Can I even take this way? Am I? I'm just walking straight into the wall. Sneak. Oh, it's a manta queen. Are you kidding me? Can I just sneak my way past it? Because listen, I don't have, I don't have the equipment to kill a manta queen. Okay, okay. First things first, let's save. We, like, I, I don't know that I have the equipment to fight a man, a whole man's queen. So, mm, is there even a way to get, I have to go past the man's queen? That's just because I can't even get, I can't even, could I though? 
Like if I took... Oh, you cannot fast travel when you're hostile. <laughs> okay. I could do Amber Heights and travel along this way. No. Because it doesn't connect. Doesn't it? I can't really read this map that well. That has become glaringly obvious to me. Ugh. In the caverns that run underneath the mountain. Yes. Okay. But how do I find that? Would it? Would it be over here somewhere? Okay, so we're just, we're going to do our best and we're going to play the look and find game where we try to find an easier, safer way to go up to Devil's Peak. Because I don't want to fight a Manta Queen. Obviously, they are a bitch to kill. So there's no going, there's no going that way. Just, just, there's just no, no, nothing for it. So we're gonna go this way. Oh, no. I'd rather kill marauders than kill a manta queen. I got another fight in me. You are very strong, ma'am. I'm really glad that you are on my side. Okay. Is that another Manta Queen? Oh, they're just fucking everywhere, aren't they? Ugh. Are you kidding me? So where's this special cavern you were talking about? Oh, come on. They got the drop on us. Did they though? Or was I just being lazy? Nice work. Can't even really see that. Don't mess with us. Yeah, girl squad. Oh, here it is. This must be it. Because it's on... Where am I? Where's my little doodad? Well, regardless. Oops. Oh, because it's right here. Yes, but... Okay, underneath... Yes, so this is it. This is it. This is it. This is it. We have found the cave. To the caverns, ladies. To the caverns. Okay, let's hope this is not the worst path to take because I have been assured by Nioka that this is the safer route And it wow it is gorgeous Ooh. That's why I love space games This is absolutely gorgeous. I hope it doesn't kill me. Oh <gasps> Look up there. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. Uh Look up. That makeshift bridge, we gotta cross it. First we go under, then hook around to the left, then up and over. Oh. Little bitty. Little bitty. Damn, but we're good. 
Oh man, they just... They just exploded. I can hear it. So we're gonna go under here. Now ma'am. I see some manta, manta babies under here. There better not be a manta queen hiding anywhere. I'm going to be real upset at you. It's a lot. Oh my god. Pretty glowy mushrooms. Okay. Um. This way. Oh, a sash. Oh, nice. Oh, that's not so nice. Dang. use the weapon parts. Oh no, I didn't want to press that button. Oh, uh, whatever. Okay. We need to get on. Set ah, okay. Up here. Tunnel here. You told, you bitch, you told me, you told me this was the safer route. What does that look like to you? It seems like no matter where I go, I'm going to have to fight a Manta Queen. Oh, I don't have the weapons to kill a Manta Queen. I certainly fucking hope you do. I hope you do, because this is your fault! You- Wait, I can sneak. I can sneak. I can take a hint. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Don't perceive me, don't perceive me, don't perceive me, don't perceive me. Okay. Okay. God damn it, Nioka! What the hell? I'm starting to really hate. Oh, son of a fucking! <gasps> Are you kidding me? <laughs> what? Sorry, I was choking. I was choking because what the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? Omega? Omega Manta Queen. You told me this would be the easier path to take. Oh my god, look at it. Oh, it's Omega Manta Queen. Oh my god. <laughs> Are you kidding me? It's huge. Oh, shit. That's a big one. We can tiptoe around to the left <laughs> or go in guns blazing. Up to you. 
I wrote the letter. You did? Well, of course you fucking would. This was your idea. I can't kill it. I can't kill it because I don't have the weapon to get it. Oh my god. Alright, alright, I have to save. I'm gonna have to save real quick because it's gonna kill me. It's a, me a mega magic queen. Do I even have a big, big, I don't have. <gasps> Wait, maybe I can shrink it. <gasps> I have the shrink ray. I, maybe I can shrink it. Hold on. It's, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to shrink it. Okay. Since this is your fault, it's gonna be up to you to smash it with your big weapon. <laughs> oh my god. I had the wrong gun out! <laughs> Where's my shirt, Ray? There we go. Okay, there we are. Alright, alright. Go get it! Go get it! Go get it! Oh, fuck! Scoot over, scoot over, scoot over, scoot over. Oh, fuck! Come on, girls. No, come on, girls. Come on. Y'all almost got it. Y'all almost got it. Come on. Come on. Please. Please. Oh, fuck. The yoke is down. No, 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 no. It's, it's literally almost dead. What weapon? I don't have a bigger weapon. Kill it. It's got one hit point left. Son of a bitch. You know what? This is valid. This, after too many encounters with manta pillars and mantisaurs, you're not quite yourself when any of the manta family of creatures are attacking your party. Okay. Yes, well. And... I am so glad I got the shrink ray. Are you kidding me? Man. That was a close one. That was a close one. Who the fuck is that? Ladies, give yourselves a round of applause. And excuse... You could have helped me. You could have... Who the fuck are you? You saw me fighting that thing. You couldn't have lent a hand. Like, at all. Uh, like, for real. For real. That assist was a violation of corporate law if I ever saw one. Since it was to my benefit, and we're largely in lawless lands, I'll look the other way. C3 owes you one, stranger. You haven't seen Constance, have you? Ah, there's her torso. And better be her legs over yonder, never mind. I'm Bertold. What in the void are you thinking, creeping around a mana queen like that? And why didn't you help? Time, I was thinking. Please don't see me. Oh, law. I don't want to die. Nah, nah, nah. Now I'm thinking it was stupid to come in here. You think? What are you doing here? Killing marauders and hooligans, as I am handsomely paid to do. Of course, as me and Constance discovered, they ain't the only forms of life inhabiting these caverns. I owe you a debt for saving my neck, stranger, and I mean to pay it. There's a station you up the way. Think? It's where my C3s are posted. We can talk more there where it's safe. I'll be on my way. Once I've gathered up Constance's parts. I want to shoot this motherfucker in the face. Oh, oh I want to shoot him in the face. Oh, you're so lucky. I am merciful. Ugh. <sighs> 
I could. I should. I should shrink him. I should shrink him and then step on him. Like the little smushy piece of crap that he is. Am I even fucking going the right way? Or did I just go the back? I went... Oh, another Manta Queen. Oh, fuck. No, this is... This, this has got to be the right way. Yes. I'm going... This is the right way. This is the right way. This was bullshit. That was, that was bullshit. He could have helped me. But no, he just stood by, let me do all the work. Here we go. Finally made it out. Oh, for crying out loud. What the hell? It's like, are you kidding me? That was supposed to be the safer route? I feel, I feel like I was bamboozled. And here we are. Told you we'd make it in one piece. Station ain't too far now. Why don't you shut the fuck up? Oh look! Oh look! I got their fucking hey, Manta Queen. There are marauders up ahead. I am so fucking sick of this planet. Why did? Oh no! How the hell did marauders navigate the caverns? This station's under the protection of the corporate <laughs> compliance crew. <laughs> you a marauder? Cause me and my sunshine, that's my gun if you were wondering, we don't take kindly to marauders. If I was a marauder, then I wouldn't tell you. <laughs> no, I'm not. A coherent enough response, I reckon. Must be true. You're clear, but I would caution you against pressing on ahead. This station's plumb crawling with marauders, you know. Shouldn't you be doing something about that? It's your job to protect the station. Me and Sunshine are doing exactly what we've been tasked with. And that's guarding these big old devil's peak horns. Well, what are you waiting for? Help me kill the marauders. There is nothing I'd enjoy more. But the C3s play it by the book. Usually. Go petition the boss man. Maybe you can convince him to alter my duties. You ought to talk to my crew. They're guarding a small barracks to the southeast, by the edge of the mountain. How do I find the other C3s? See that path that runs underneath that giant archway? Follow it on down. There's a little station near the cliff. You'll find the rest of my crew there. All right, um... I just got up the mountain. I do not want to go back down the mountain. Because she's talking about like over here or in this area. be able to convince them to help you. What if I just go and shoot all of the marauders myself? It's not like I need their help. It's not like I need the C3's help. Okay. I guess. I don't know. I'm just gonna walk the fuck around. I, no, I, we'll, we'll just see. We'll, we will see. 
this way, huh? No, because those are marauders too. And those are marauders. There's just marauders everywhere. Oh shit, this guy's got a flamethrower. Shoot him! In the face! Down and dirty. Killed him. <laughs> so I have no freaking clue. I don't know where she wanted me to go. She said the south. Southeast? It's like down the mountain, isn't it? Look, I need detailed. And I mean detailed instructions. Okay, you can't just tell me, go this direction. Sundered, sundered, sundered rock discovered. So what's up here? What's this? The hammer of Olympus? Oh? Oh, did I get a new weapon? I think I just got a new weapon. Cool. Alright, let's, let's speed this up a little bit. Ugh. All right. I think. See, they're hanging out right there. I wonder if Hiram's home. <laughs> Just kidding. Guy never sets foot outside. This place mm. is supposed to look like horns. I don't see it. Yeah, me either. Oh, what's that? Oh, no. No. No, 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 no. No, I think it would just be easier just to go in and shoot up the place myself. Yeah, that that would be. You know what? That's fine. I'll just do that. Uh. God damn, she took him out quick. Ellie, move out the way so I don't shoot you in the head! Oh, motherfuckers. Uh. What the? Oh, dang it. I didn't even realize that dog was attacking me. Where? Uh -huh. Oh my god! Get down. You got him. Uh, uh, with something else. Uh, 
Oh shit! Oh no! Oops! I'm sorry! Don't step in my line of sight! I will shoot you! Alright, let's go up the stairs. The girls are already working hard. Okay. What's this? That's the last of them. They're just running around shooting things, and here I am looking for loot. So is this this it? Can I just go inside now? Hiram must have sealed the door. He's he spooks easy. Oh, he does, does he? So then we'll go down here, where the map is telling us. That was easier than trying to figure out wherever the hell that lady was trying to take, tell me to go. I'm playing on normal. So, those ladies are, are pretty strong. What the? Are you kidding me? Is Hiram even alive? What is that? You may not realize this being as you're an outsider, but the blaring alarms indicate the station's on lockdown. Which means you can't ever get to me. So leave already. <laughs> can't? We'll see about that. Huh? Here we go! <laughs> ah! Nailed him, Captain! Ooh, I keep pressing the wrong button. God damn, she just. I need the heels. She incinerated him. God damn. God damn, Miss Ma'am. Ooh. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Get in the stash. Oh. Oh, oh. Take that to sell later. I do not like the elite armor. It is too bulky looking for me. I think I saw something like this on The Walking Dead, huh? Oh, shit. Okay. Barb, the new environmental controls terminal is now installed and running upstairs. Congratulations. You messaged corporate about it. You yet you get to manage it. Consider this your official notice to hide its access key card deep in the bottom of a drawer somewhere, preferably within the archives or in one of the station's other popular sections. Because I sure as hell will not allow our station's efficiency scores to plummet due to a pointless safety feature. Don't even think about it. Though don't even think about testing the system out. The emergency sirens will make your ears bleed, and if you accidentally trigger the fire suppression system, it it can suck the air from the room faster than the station's last performance review. Val. Ew. Is that everything? I think so. What is that? Is this an ammo? Oh. Actually, it's probably a good idea to see about repairing all of my stuff. Do I need to repair any of this? I guess not. Hmm. Now let's see about... Oh, yeah, got some more consumable slots. Okay. Let's put the ones that we have the most of, I guess. You know what, let's just, um... 
Let's just start using some of this. Let's see. What is... Oh, no. Oh, why would I even want that? Oh my god. It does nothing. Body attributes. What about this one? Oh, bonus. Two extra headshot. Okay, we'll use this one. To get some drugs. Don't do drugs. <gasps> oh! Here we go! Keep this up and I won't have any new battle scars. Oh. Died taking a shit. I don't feel bad. Alright. You out there. Whoever you are. Yes, yes, I can see you. Come here and talk to me. Face the intercom. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Give me a second while I loot everything. I can't tell if you're brave or simply touched in the head. A little bit of both. Are you doing sniffing around my station? Unless you are, in fact, trying to suicide by Marauder. And you, Nioka, what are you doing lugging a stranger into my station? Maybe. You could use the socialization, you son of a bitch. Me, 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 me. Also, she hired me. To what purpose? I happen to have some significant problems I am dealing with right now. We all got problems. Running out of purple berry wine three days ago, not being able to bloody broadcast. I need to see the information broker about. No, no, no. We'll deal with information related business later. As I said, there are bigger problems threatening my life and livelihood at this very moment. Oh, goodness. The marauders want me dead. And since my hired hands have clearly turned to idle, it appears I need you to clear out the threat. As my newest contractor, you may call me the broker. You sound like a nerd. Or we can call you Hiram, on account of that's your damn name, and doubly on the account of the broker being a dumbass alternative. What? Everyone calls me that, aside from you. Sound like a nerd. How do I know? Because I'm a nerd. <laughs> okay, broker. See, Nioka? I barricaded the broadcast center, but I can only hold out for so long. Clear the marauders out, and I'll pay you double the going rate. They destroy the transmission equipment, and I'll be out of business. Oh, the elevator okay. and doors to the second floor are back online. Hurry before I have to lock them down again. I'll see what I can do. Oh, that... you dumbass. I was trying to... What's up? Oh. I'm pressing the wrong button. Alright. Go up there, huh? All right. Let's see. Where do we go? Hey, elevators to your right. Get ready. All right, ladies, guns out. Sneaking around. Oh. We'll just we'll just do it this way. Back up! 
Oh. That one was not as good as I thought it was. Libations on me, folks. She really likes to smack things around with that big hammer of hers. I really, really like these cards. I wonder if Obsidian would consider selling them. Stated in my prior four messages, there is simply no cause for alarm. I swear to you, Hiram, the situation is under control. What you call a near emergency, I would consider a non-event. Yes, a high energy transmission was used for too lengthy a period of time. And yes, the generators cannot safely support that activity. Yes and yes, they could have been damaged under load. But the point remains, nothing happened. We caught the issue in time. The engineers involved were reprimanded. I swear on my mama's grave it will not happen again. Now please, cease contacting me for daily updates on the status of the generators. Thank you, Val. What in the black hole were you thinking, Val? At some point, space efficiency becomes the inverse to time efficiency and one negates the other. What I mean is, how am I to do my morning business when the toilets are directly facing the open showers? You might like watching fellows <laughs> screw up their jigglies <laughs> when you take a steaming dump, but I don't. <laughs> Sincerely, thanks for the peep show. Not really. That was sarcasm, Theodore. <laughs> That's valid. <laughs> That's a valid complaint. <laughs> Because I, too, would not want to look at people scrubbing their ass cracks while I was taking a shit. <laughs> oh my god. On the contrary, Theo, not only is it a spatially efficient design, but it also encourages simultaneous users to hurry their business. Don't like, don't look, or speed it up and move on. After all, the faster you're back to your station, the happier we all will be. Warm as regards, Val. Postscript, you take too many bathroom breaks and you know it. Okay, miss, ma'am. <laughs> but I agree with Theo. <laughs> I have, that is a horrible design for a bathroom. Horrible. No, oh, I don't want to pick up the food. Oh, I didn't even want to pick up that cigarette lighter. I have a trigger finger right now. I'm just picking up things. That I need. That, that I needed. Let's see. Ooh. Oh. And this, and this. Oh, can I, can I hack it? Ha 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 ha. Hmm. Hmm. I could activate the fire alarm. Deploy fire suppressant systems in the main hall. Do that. I better save. The last time I did this, I died when I walked out into the other room. That's the last of them, I think. 
So I just killed them all. I killed all of them? Really? Every single one of them? Where does this go? Oh, okay. This is the front door, it looks like. I don't know. He said he liked that purple berry wine stuff. Oh, that's the terminal I just read. How do I get up there? No, this is this is where I came in. Yes, this is where I came in from. Okay. <laughs> Just a little confused. This way. Oh, look. They're all dead. It's a good thing I chose the hacker route. Oh, the stairs. Okay, I can use those stairs. I'm just going to loot everything. There's just a lot to loot. Goodness, there's just so much. That's an explody barrel. Okay. Up, up, up. Up, 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 up. So much stuff. I would have had to fight those guys, but now I don't have to. Ah, Marauder free at last! I'll get the door. Do hurry on it. Hi, Hero. Hello! Never thought I'd be ecstatic at having the walls painted in blood, but... Seeing as it's not mine, I'd say this calls for a celebration. My compliments on your improvised utilization of the fire suppressant system. I would expect nothing less from one of Neoka's associates. Well, thank as you. usual, I'll take that as a compliment. Of course. This ought to square our debt. One hefty payment oh, nice. for a highly valued service rendered. But, I admit, I do wonder why Neoka has brought you to me. Allow me to pose my question in another manner. Why, in the nebula, are you here? Okay. Well. You're not an easy man to reach, broker. That is the primary goal behind locking myself high in a tower. Some folks don't look kindly on me being a purveyor of delicate information. Okay. Phineas must have sent you. He's the only one insane enough to send someone to Monarch to rush me. I knew it was only a matter of time before he came a-knocking. Look, I might be late, but I fulfill my contracts always. Okay. Oh, you do, do you? I have lost track of the number of beers you owe me for chasing raptodons off your stoop. Careful. I know that line. I use it all the time. I take offense to that. Look, okay. I was delayed by MSI and the Iconoclasts. The idiots were scrambling all transmissions to override each other's broadcasts. But as you've shut them down, I'm back in business. Did I shut them I down? I don't doubt that you are working with Phineas, but my contract specifies I relay any acquired information to the purchaser, and to the purchaser alone. However, to send the data, I will need your assistance in cycling the antenna's receiver so of I can input the needed adjustments. Of course. Phineas doesn't trust many people. How'd he hook up with you? You make it sound so scandalous. Phineas has been in hiding for the past 35 years. He got in touch with Nioka first, who I use as a physical go-between. The rest is history. Now you hold on. I do not physically go between anyone but that of my choose... Oh. Oh. Apologies. <laughs> you meant... Right. Yes. I brave the wilderness so you don't have to. <laughs> Pick your mind up out of the gutter, really Miss Ma'am. <laughs> <sighs> Tell me how to fix it. It's simple, truly. I merely need you to waltz outside and throw the lever to cycle the power. I'll key in the numerical adjustments from in here. 
Alright. Except it needs three keys before it'll activate and I have to find them, right? Eternal, no. What is wrong with you? Who would ever design something like that? However, well, you're welcome to brew me a Rizzo <laughs> instant coffee surprised. from the staff kitchen on your way back. Just step outside, flip the switch, depart forever. Understood? Good. Marvelous. We're in agreement. This is why I stopped helping out around here, you know. It's always throw this lever, shoot that marauder, save my life. Just one thing after another with you. I'm starting to see why you don't get much company out here. Cranky old hermit. Terrific. I'll be here. Waiting with bated breath. Give a shout if the panel electrocutes you. Oh, these are rocks. Me, 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 me. I'm Hiram, and I like to hide away because I don't like people. Me, me, me. It's not ceiling if it's not red. And I'm taking all your bits. So suck on that, Hiram. I better level up. Are you kidding me? Can I not level up anything? Oh. Oh, don't say. Can I not level up anything else? Is it or does, oh, it probably cost too many points? I'm just not realizing that. I've been playing video games for years, and you would think, oh, you know, cost so many points. Oh, okay. Huh. Personal files. Dare I say, the future is looking bright. Indeed, I can run a full gamut of operations without ever leaving the sanctuary of the broadcast room. Sanjar and Graham are living up to their promises and have not interfered with initial broadcast. Deal is holding, and I, I believe I can make a life here. Had a near miss the other day. Nearly ended up with the board on my trail. We will mark that trail trial firmly in the failure carador, category. Ooh, goodness. One must experiment, however, to ascertain the best methods. I have found this far that the most reliable method for evading detection within the limited frequency of Monarch's off-world transmissions involves duplicating regular news broadcasts on several unused frequencies. My information gathering associates know how to filter out the sounds in the vocal range, in turn isolating the embedded data. And the board's authorities are none the wiser. Playing hazard has never been so thrilling. No high stakes. Po pox it all. Bleh. Pox it all. These Im imbecilic children and their hatred of each other. Sanjar and Graham have oversaturated my key bands. They'll take down each other all right and me right alongside them. I should have never invited them to play. But what about what to do about it now? What to do indeed. Wait a minute. Oops. I need to... Yeah. Let's see. <laughs> Jump in the gun. Alright. I'm gonna go flip the switch. And then I'm gonna call it a night. On the flip of the switch. I hope I don't die. Is 
Sounds like a cell phone going off. Testing one, two, check, check. Sweet stars. But that is a beautiful sound. Can you hear me? We are a go for broadcast. Oh, and I also dispatched Phineas his data. Impatient prick. Worse, I'm now indebted to him for it. Now I'll kindly thank you to get out of my tower. Alright, you cranky bitch. Don't make me come back in there. There's no need to assert your dominance. I doubt I could make you do anything you don't wish to. Look, I am well aware that at times I may have the tiniest iota of a prickly exterior. But I must admit, I have grown rather fond of you. <laughs> Whoa now, As buddy. Can attest, I do not form attachments with many. Do take care. Why, he told us to leave without flinging insults at our persons. He really does like you, Captain. Anyone else hear a high-pitched whining? Did I get tinnitus, or is that just Hiram? What is that sound? No. No. What is that? What the fuck? What was that? Did you see that? Whose ship was that? Looks like a UDL ship. Based on the gunnery attachments, I guess it's one of the board's blockade enforcers, but don't cite me on that. Oh well, a pity for the crew, but I can't see how it affects me. Hiram? Can you hear me? Did you see that? Oh, I still need to do oh, their main quest. Sanjar, what are you bloody doing on my channel? Did MSI or did MSI not cease broadcasting? Yes, but... Hiram? Hiram, are you there? Huh, it's a reunion group hug. Not without a physical contact waiver. Ah, the good captain. The truth brings us together once more. Our salvation has come crashing through the stratosphere. We need only collect its weapons. Are you mad? That's a UDL gunship. You'd probably shoot your own toes off. You're acting like children. Par for the course, really. You should do like I did. Get out while you still retain a shred of sanity. We could use the gunship's armaments to defend Stellar Bay, but we need its targeting module. Our message is so close to breaking free of this planet and spreading to the stars. Help us secure that module and we will save our colony. Listen, I don't care a single whit what you do, so long as you leave me out of it. Oh my god. Which means, get off my void damn channel! I am more than finished with you lot. Oh, oh god, this is... I'm gonna have to choose, and I'm not even done with their, this is, oh, I'm not even done with their main quest. Like, I still have to do, I still have to do this, Sucker Bait, which is part of the cult quest line. I still have to do this for Sanjar. What? And I still have to ask the broker about Nyoka's friends. Ugh. We're gonna... Okay. Well. Like I said. That was the last thing I was doing. So. Um, so anyway. I'm, I'm just gonna call it. I'm gonna call it a night. So. Hmm. Next time. We'll talk to the broker again about Nyoka's friends. And then we will try to do one of the faction quests. That's what's on the agenda for tomorrow. Anyway. Um, go check out my YouTube channel. Um, same name, Lady Catastrophe. I am currently uh, playing the Five Nights at Freddy's games on the weekends. So I've been posting videos there. And... Um, I'll be playing the Outer Worlds. I'll be continuing the Outer Worlds throughout the week. So. Anyway, this is Lady Catastrophe signing off.